gorgeous. So guys, it is our last day in Japan and we're really sad about it. Yeah, I'm gutted. So it's been an absolutely amazing time that we've had over the past like, what, nine days? Uh, yeah, this tomorrow. will be our 10th day. Yeah, we're gonna go out and explore the like actual Osaka. Um, we went to Universal Studios yesterday and it was absolutely amazing. And mm. um, hopefully, you've watched that vlog already. And yeah, we'll see what we get up to today. Sean has made an itinerary. Yeah, I've made a plan for today visiting all the main sites and trying a bit of the um, food offerings as well. So excited to stick to this plan yeah so it's raining we were gonna rent a bike because it's the best way to get around kind of japan and stuff like that however it is raining so we are definitely not gonna do that um so i'll show you guys the view from the window because when we arrived it was dark excuse me dark so this is the view from our window we're on the ninth floor down there is the mclaren shop and then over there is a Lamborghini shop so we're in like a very high-end kind of business district with all of like the fancy shops and cars and stuff um, and we will link the hotel down in the description box because it is like in a perfect location it's like a minute walk from a train station and it's about 15-20 minute walk to Don Toburi Dotonbury, yeah. Dotonbury. The food place. Which is the food, like the street food um, market area, which we went to on our first night when we arrived. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this last Japan vlog. So sad, but I'm sure that we will be back to do all the other stuff that we haven't done because, seriously, like Japan has been a dream. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love you. Gonna miss it a lot and hopefully be back soon. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoy this vlog. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button um, so you can follow us for more of our travels. Peace. Ooh, look at that 
Good. Nice. I feel like I've got all oh, the fish. <laughs> This is the view from the bar. From the photos, I actually thought that this was a swimming pool. <laughs> it's cool, but it's a castle. That's actually a really cool look. So it's Osaka Castle. The I think the um, semi-circles are going up. I represent the rivers and the little um, things in between are the little houses. Or yeah, I would say that's. I think I'm it. This is our last night in Japan. Like we said um, this morning, that was the sad It was very, very sad thing to last night. Yeah, if, we, if genuinely, if we hadn't booked the flights to Vietnam, uh, we would have just stayed longer in Japan. <laughs> Cannot recommend the island off. It's been my favourite country I think I've ever been in. Um, and that's a strong claim, but. I've absolutely loved it and I can't wait to come back but I'd strongly recommend it to anyone put it at the top of your list and book a flight, get it done We're just enjoying a drink at the bar and then we're going to go to a observatory mm. um, before it closes to go watch um, Osaka in the evening which will be really really nice but for now we're just waiting for our drinks and I'll show you when they arrive Thank you Thank you Glass is cool. It looks like there's blood coming from your glass. It's like a Halloween glass. And the really cool is that you can use mask cases, which is And that view. Oh, it smells really good. How's your drink? It's nice. We are at the Umeda Sky Building and we're 36 floors up in the sky um, and we are just having a little browse around and we're in this little section here called Architecture so it shows you how place was kind of built and it also echoes in here which is very fun so We're gonna go up to the 
Skywalk now. Skywalk. Let's see what that is all about. We are up in the skies. What a stunning view of Osaka on our last day in Japan. Damn. <laughs> right, let's walk around all the way. This is the vibe. Look at the bridges. It's gorgeous. I just feel like skylines in the evening are so pretty. Do you not agree? Yeah, in a city like this. Sure. Yeah, and also it's not like super windy up here, no, which it's nice is nice. And calm. It's not super busy up here, which is nice, and it's also not super windy. Otherwise, we'd be getting blown over, and I definitely would not be filming up here if it was like mega windy. So mm -hmm. it's like the perfect temperature and the perfect wind conditions. Perfect end to Japan. Yeah. So I'll let you guys enjoy the sky view of the city and I just want to say thank you so much for joining us here in Japan it's been absolutely amazing the food the people the culture everything that we've experienced has been absolutely phenomenal so we just want to say thank you Japan arigato gozaimasu arigato gozaimasu thank you <laughs> it's the best thing to learn so yeah we will see you in our next country so see you later Vietnam